Welcome back, everybody. I am C Money. I'm a Grandmaster level Risk Global Domination player, and today we're playing Progressive Capitals on the Europe Advanced map. We're playing as the green player out of the second position. We have a black bot in the third position, and we have uh, some interesting opportunities afforded to us here. I have access to the one point Gascony hold, I have access to a two point noob corner. Maybe I'll take the new two-point new corner. I got a ton of material up here that I can use. I don't really get Scandinavia, and maybe we we get the black cap to, to uh, drop down here. That would be interesting. Um, red should cap probably here on this three. We'll see. It, it, that's very card blockable up there. Not a very grandmaster move. We could cap down here. Very easy early bonus, but I, I don't know. I feel like the noob corner, noob corner is fun. Why not? Yep, we get the black cap right in front of us. So um, somebody else is going to snag, uh, snag that most likely, which is a little bit unfortunate, but um, that's okay. Yep, red cap's here right next to the bot. Although that bot might actually stay on this longer than... Red probably gets free access to that. If the bot was ahead of me, this play might have been better. I, I maybe should have capped Gascony to not... Uh, since blue wasn't capped in here, I didn't even factor that in, that the fact that the blue was not capped in there. Uh, but we're playing the, the progressive capital settings here. You can find them, uh, find them right here. It is, uh, Europe advanced progressive capitals. Alliances and portals are off. Fog and blizzards on automated AI behavior. 60 second turn timer, auto setup, expert level AI and progressive cards with balance plus dice. Tons of material up here, quite frankly. Um, I take at least the UK. Blue's gonna hit me. Why do you hit me? Blue might have taken this bonus, but if he takes this bonus, I don't know why he wouldn't have capped in a better spot back there, but that's fine. Um, all right, we're gonna go here. Whatever I don't take out of here will fortify the capital, and hopefully the bot will not roll me. Got a bit of white behind me. bit of red behind me. I'm going to just fortify this out. I don't want to risk the bot rolling me. Not a risk I'm willing to take. Bot places a bunch next to white over there. So I can two point noob corner hold. Uh, the issue with these cap this capital orientation is you know, the bot's going to come off. Red's going to get this. I really don't know why it would roll off cap when it borders two capitals but that's unfortunate because red is going to get this cap. Uh, most likely. Maybe he'll get a bad roll and I can scoop it up myself. It does help that he, you know, he might, he's going to get like seven troops, 13 on four. Um, not bad. White comes out of, of Finland. Interesting. Um, by the way, this game is, is live on Twitch. I don't, I, I'm in a phase where I'm not getting too many Twitch viewers, but if you manage to come over to Twitch and, and maybe I'll start streaming on YouTube too, who knows? Uh, it, it, please don't knock me out of there. Please just come down. Okay, thank God. I, I really, I have too much material up in Scandinavia to deal with that. He unfortunately does not roll the bot on this past turn. So that's a little sad. But, um, he's going to border guard me up there. That was a bit of a body fortify. Um, all right, we'll take this crap out of here and just fortify this way. And if he, if he bad neighbors me, uh, I'll, I'll deal with it. And we roll the, the bot cap on the next turn, hopefully. Um, I could cripple red early. But I, I don't think that's the right play. Um, ah, it might be the right play. Angering him. He didn't fortify anything to cap. Do I just anger him? It's going to depend on how many troops I get in this next turn. But I th honestly think just knocking him out of here might even be a better play than, than what I had originally planned. Um, I assume blue is taking this bonus. White, I don't... White does not have Russia yet. No clue where pink is. Um, blue has, in fact, taken this bonus. White does not have Russia. No clue. I assume pink is bottom left. Black is bot. Yeah, I mean, red's effectively my neighbor. I, I don't know that it's in my best interest to let them hold anything. You know, they, they defend these borders, but at what cost, right? So, 
Oh, Blue might come scoop this cap. That's something I didn't consider. Uh, let's try the four on two first. We lose it. That's fine. We're fortified like this so he can't get through me. I need to bad neighbor this player. It's unfortunate, but I think it's the right play. Because I, I can't let him hold it, hold this bonus. I put this three over here so that if he tries to put like a four up here and come break me, he's not able to do so. Um, I honestly it was part of the back of my mind hoping that he just bots out. Um, but I normally normally don't like bad neighbor, but I think bad neighbor is the right play in this circumstance. As long as if white keeps this here, I should be fine. He's going to go for his Russia bonus. Totally okay. Or at least come close to it. He might even complete it. And then we remove him on the next turn. But I basically don't want red to be able to knock me out of here. He's only got six on cap. He put nothing on cap. I believe. Or he might have put two on cap. He does go up here. I was wondering if he was going to do that. And he's going to have to hit through my three. Loses two. That's fine. Not a great play from you, fella. And he opens this up so that I can remove him. That quite possibly the worst the worst way he could have played this. Um, and then points the four over this way. So I still have material out here I can break him with. So I can just take all of this back. I didn't expect him to dump his entire thing up there. I was hoping he would just give up and try to roll this, but seemingly not what happened. We've got pink eking out over here. It's blue. Interesting. Very confused by the, the nature of everybody's play here. Um, Blue's probably going to take this cap on the next turn. This is going to get out of hand. I don't know. Maybe maybe going for red in that, in that scenario may not have been the right play, but... Um, didn't expect him to dump his entire stuff up there. I guess I uh, arguably overestimated him and not underestimated him. Because I would, if I, in that situation, I probably wouldn't have dumped, dumped my entire amount in there. Yeah, oh, 20. Okay. Cool. Yeah, so we're just going to go up this way and dump all of our stuff on cap so we don't lose our cap. Because uh, blue has a very strong hold. I'm just going to take this out. We're going to leave white alone. 12 cap is still... Uh, it's an 11 cap. It's not even... I lost some troops there, didn't I? I should, probably should have slidered. I uh, lost two along the pathing. The issue is red's going to come break me, but then red might just lose his cap to, uh, to blue as well. So let's get out of hand fast. I should have taken this bonus down here. I wasn't even paying attention to that. That was That was a mistake on my part. We'll take this on the next turn. Um, just to add, maybe I should have done I should have done that last turn, taking red out of here so that I have the bonus to play from. White, yeah, and white's dealing with somebody giving them the business up in here. He takes his bonus. He's gonna keep coming. Yeah, this is gonna be an issue with taking this bonus down here. I'm not gonna commit any troops to this, assuming blue doesn't hit me. Um, but if red, oh my god, it's like this guy is stream sniping. How would you think to take that? Ah, I missed that opportunity. I, I should have... Mm. This is what happens when you're massively distracted. Um, wow. Places all that... He's going to lose his cap. I think he'd lose his cap before I would. He had, what, maybe eight on this? Just fortify two back? So he's got max ten, because we saw he dumped his entire troop count down here. Six on three succeeds with only losing one. Uh, he'll have this bonus for now. See how long that holds. Wow. Brutal. Brutal mistakes. Very tough. Um, if blue doesn't hit me... Well, let's see what blue does first, right? Because, like, if I if blue hits me, it's just a, it's a lost cause. Game over, man. Um... If blue doesn't hit me, we'll, we'll deal. We'll deal with it. All right, blue, you're going to get, like, what, 15 here? 
16 probably. What are you going to do? Yeah, there's the 16. You want to do 26 on 10? Or do you want to do 26 on 11? It only puts 3 here. Hopefully somebody knocks it right out of here. So we'll get rid of we'll get rid of white. Yeah, I just I don't know. Now that blue has this being a bad neighbor to red doesn't really help me as much, but red's probably not going to treat me with any respect either. So, um an 8. We'll just take white out of here. Tradings are going to come in soon anyway, so. Not going to break him. Going to hope something or someone else does. Now, if black was only on this one territory, I remember seeing it on Greece. Hopefully it breaks red down here. But red's going to get a lot on this next turn. I've given up on, on hitting red solely because of the... Uh, the blue player having this capital now. I'm kind of crap. I'm kind of screwed, but maybe white takes in the middle of the board. Maybe white breaks red, something like that. We're going to have a tough time advancing in this one. The bot capping in front of me was very unfortunate. I thought it might happen. Figured, eh, it should be okay. And then it was not very much not okay. Should have taken this bonus down here. Critical. Yeah, so I, uh, red got broken down here, it seems. They're going to try to knock me out up here? So he came out of this pocket, seemingly... I thought I thought pink was in that pocket. Huh. I think we hit we place troops here. We hit blue on the next turn to make it harder for blue to kill me if he tries to do that. Pink's getting five. Was pink getting five before? I have no idea who's down in the bottom left here. I thought it would have been pink, but maybe blue is capped. No, nah, eh. blue could be capped down here. Not in this bonus. That'd be interesting. This game we got out of hand real fast. We've changed our tune. We're going to be nice to red for now. I don't really want to. But I will. Whew. Pink's doing too much attacking for the quantity of troops that they're getting, in my opinion. All right. So the players in our game, we got the blue player, General Batala, from the United States in the first position. I'm seeing my grandmaster level player in the second position from... The United States playing as green. The black player was a bot. A botted player originally General Willis, but botted out before the game started. We got the white player in the fourth position, General Monk from the United States. The red player in the fifth position, Delos Gonzalez from Mexico. And then finally, the pink player, General Lenka from the United States in the sixth position. Those are the players that we've got here. We're chilling. We're having a good time. Um, yeah, it's a vibe. Blue's hitting somebody. They ain't hitting me. So, that's nice. We're getting 11 now. And we'll have our trade on five. When it gets to that, defend ourselves from red just in case. Though I'd like to sit on this, but I'm not going to sit on that until after the first set of trades come in. Red could force my hand. That's the thing. If red breaks me, or not breaks me, but removes my externals, that would force my hand. 
I think White is actually in the best position to win this game right now. The left side's too cluttered. My cap is dog water. Um, and Black Bot dies, so White sets in. White's going to be four set early, but it's a smart play. That does get us up to the uh, 10 trade instead of the 8 trade. We would have been on the 6 if Black had not traded. Uh, the, bot, the bot had not traded itself. It's only a two-card gain, but White's going to be able to take a bunch of the right side of the map with that. So I think Red knows that. Red should hopefully not aggress me. But you never know. Red sets in early. That's even better because that means I can comfortably break Red. He's hitting somebody. Oh, he's hitting White. Interesting. It's a very weird play. Yeah. That's just going to put a target on your back, dude. What was the point of that? White must have broken him down here or something. Come out of this pocket, swing up and around, and try to hit White as hard as he could? Uh, I'm not sure, but... You do you, I guess, dude. I think that's a really bad play by Red. Because now I can break red comfortably and he can't retaliate. He can remove my externals, but at least this gives me some options. Why is everybody setting in? This is actually worrisome because blue could maybe take my cap now. Letting blue get up to 12 on the trade. I'm going to get the 15 trade. I don't deserve this. I'm in the second position and I didn't skip and I'm getting the 15. That's nuts. Purple maybe just set to survive. I don't know. Or uh, pink, I mean, maybe set to survive. I don't know why red traded. That didn't make a whole lot of sense to me. Um, hmm. Because white's seemingly going to hit red, right? Pink's going to fortify this out. I think pink's probably our next casualty. Blue's not defending their cap very very much, given how much they've been getting each turn. They set in. They're going to defend the cap now. Just with five. Wow. I wonder if they got another stack that's going to whack red's cap. Because I would trade in and kill red if that was the case. He's slidering something. If we see that jump to three... It's either, purple, it's either pink or, or red who's been hit, but we don't see it jump, so he might have just hit a stack. I wonder if pink was defending off cap. Random users! Red is annoying, he should bot. <laughs> I don't disagree. Welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Uh, Alright, well, my doggy doo-doo capital exists. Let's get this up to... 30 should be fine. Operate with a 6, 7, 8. Let's have an, like an 8 out here. Uh, I, I want to fortify this away from that spot. I'm not going to hit white. We are going to hit red. I want this away from white. I, I don't want to inconvenience white. I'm trying to get away from him. Um... But we break red. White's playing from here. He, little does he know, I already broke red. So we'll actually get to see how much is on this capital. White doesn't take any of his stuff back. So red getting eight, I think, is solely off of territory count. Seven in here. Is he going to try to kill pink? If pink is not... Killable. Blue didn't take Pink's cap. This is not a good play. Hit it, whacking that three did nothing for him. Do I have a set on three? I have a set on three. I wonder if I could take Red's cap. I think he's been defending it a little bit too strong lately. Um, White still has to set. Oh, Pink botted. That's not good. 
That's three cards. Set and kill pink. Blue is taking at least Italy. Has not removed pink from the bottom left. So if blue is not aware of this material here, and he, he thinks he's got a kill, I could potentially... I'll have first dibs on this pink kill. Um, I have to defend my capital, though. We, if we see this jump to three, we'll know he's taking pink's cap. Because he has black's cap on his own. He's not very fast, so I don't think he's going to have the wherewithal to find pink once he fails the kill. We just got it. Yeah, so there's it. there it is to three. Is he going to get this, to this two in time? Does he have the troops to get over there? He can't. Red's cap hasn't blocked. Yeah, he doesn't get it. All right, so I'm going to set in. I'm going to make sure I have enough externally here. We're going to set on three. Just in case there's lurking pieces of pink around. Let's get like a 25, 20, 27. That's what we'll roam around with the rest on our cap. White's down in here. We might have to loop around. Uh, or blue is smart, you know? Did I feed this kill? Oh, I totally fed the kill. Where? Unfortunate. Why didn't blue just kill him? Oh, that's okay. If red doesn't have a set, I think red dies to white here anyway. White might go f try to find that pink kill, but that's that's really unfortunate. I was trying to trying to kill the bot. Unless it's in here, the white was holding that hostage down in here. That would be smart. He's gonna take this bonus. He's not even gonna kill red, is he? Maybe he is. Maybe he tries for it. I think blue should theoretically kill red here. Gonna take all this. Does he hit blue off the no? All right, what does red do? Because blue should blue should see these troops place here and just kill him if he doesn't set. Like that would be the best play: kill pink, kill red, win the game. I mean, it's it's pretty cut and dry, simple as that. Red's probably gonna retaliation kill me because I took all of those territories out. I wasn't even trying to hit him. He might come open my cap. If he opens my cap, he dies. Does he open the cap? Loop all the way around. Take all this junk. I don't care. No, he does not open the cap. So he just dies anyway. Pink sets on three, maybe? Nope. All right, so pink... Yeah, pink just gives th blue three cards. Good game. The game is over. Red, red doing that in retaliation, even though, again, didn't... I, I, I guess I did break him before that. He won't set off of this. Does he kill red first? Does he feed me red? I mean, if I'm him, I leave enough... Yeah, he's going to leave enough troops here to kill Red, but if he's too slow in killing Pink and making these decisions, maybe, just maybe, he does not kill... He kills Pink now. Yep. But he doesn't set in off of that, so if he's too slow in killing Red... Like, if he rolls this cap... If he doesn't roll the cap and he lets Red live, he's insane... You got, this is the end of red, bro. Take the capital. Take the capital. Why are you hitting me? What is going on? He doesn't roll the cap, so red lives. That's really sad. Mm, okay. Unless white kills him. But... Maybe I can kill him. Be best dice roll of my life. I'm gonna try. What have I got to lose? Other than all of these troops. I'm trying... Yeah, there it is. <laughs> I was trying to show... Uh, 
To show blue, he should have killed red, but he didn't do it. So maybe white will go do it. Good game. I'm trying. Come on, white. You know you got to go kill him. Yes, good game. Well played. Good on you. That's not the end of what? Oh my god, where is red? Oh, he's up there. He was up there, so I wasn't going to get that anyway. Well played. Good for white. Well played. Oh, do not. What? Dude. Why would you leave that for him to take? That's such a bad play. No. Come on, man. You can't be giving out freebies. That's terrible. Oh, I hate that so much. All right, how can I turn this game around? Because Blue's going to hit me. He's going to hit me and then he's going to take this cap, right? Might even loop it. No, he's just going to take it straight up and then might even try to card block me, which will work for a little bit. He breaks white. Interesting. So I get this cap for free then. That's what that tells me. Which I'd rather have this cap than the one I had, that's for sure. <laughs> for the late game, at least. And hopefully white's pissed enough here where he just continues hitting blue. Yes, perfect. If I can get these two to fight each other, I can win this game. And by playing like a weenie, I played a bit, I played like a weenie for most of this game. I have not made an enemy out of white. That is what's very big in this game. I have not made an enemy out of white. I don't have a set now. I'm going to take this Orient bonus and hope white doesn't mind. And then we're going to put troops on cap. We're going to take Orient. Hope white doesn't care. Since Blue's, Blue's been getting the most troops of anybody all game, White. The only thing that can turn this game on the on its head is if Blue stops hitting White. Because these two could totally team on me. I'm, I'm not in a good position. But, it seems like that's not the case. It seems like he is, in fact, hitting, hitting a lot of White. Actually came by White's cap there. And as such, white should have pathing back down into here on the next turn. Um, runs out of time, doesn't get any of that back to a cap, so we're going to put five down here. Yeah, I'll throw you the fisties. I'll throw you the fist bumps. Get this up to snuff. I'm just going to keep that back. Yeah, I, I hit you, bro, but we're good. I hit you in, in territory you don't even... You don't even own. Yeah. If he breaks me, I'm going to be upset. No, he's hitting blue back. Okay. Ooh, he didn't hit blue enough. This could be bad. I could lose a capital or two here. I've got to set in pronto. It's not over, White. We work together. This game's not over. This player's not fast enough. This is winnable for sure. Winnable for sure. Blue sets in. Is blue going to go fully into white? Because that's the other thing is I haven't really gone into blue yet. I went into blue only searching for that pink kill. So he might not aggress me. Who would have thunk that potential passiveness in this game is what could maybe lead me to survival? White doesn't break me down here. I'm just going to take this bonus, fortify my caps, and hope that white hits blue. Blue doesn't do a whole lot of attacking on this turn either. Single, Singular attack. Defends himself here. 
makes enough sense. I'm going to set in. Just defend this a little bit more. And then big capital here. Somehow, some way, we have ended up in a not completely terrible position. White actually holds 22. So we let white hold a little bit more. It's me. So he's not going to anger blue at all here. There's a card block opportunity for sure on blue. A very easy one, actually. It's a, a two-pointer plus capital right here. Obviously, this cap needs to be well defended enough. Um, that seven is eerie up there. Yeah, blue's kind of slow. If we can just get ourselves strong... White waits to set. I wonder if White was going to wait to make his move until this turn where he sets. Hmm. 30, 39 troops he drops here. That's a lot of troops. Yeah, Blue's making very slow decisions. You got to take a card, man. Started with so he dropped all those troops. That was all of his troops. I he's gonna miss a card. Interesting. Okay. Not sure if that was intentional or not. I will also I'm in the same boat, bro. Eighty seven on this cap. We got 133. We got a 50 cap up here. We're definitely stronger than white. White's going to set in now, though, to basically match our strength in terms of this capital here. Don't think white's going to bad neighbor me. But this is this game is taking a weird turn. We've had a lot of players botting out when being the strongest players in the past. Although blue did exhaust a lot of their troops trying to take out pink, as far as I could tell, at least. Three-player game. We're about 20 troops stronger than white right now. If blue bots out, it's going to change the course of this game. The bot will hit white before it hits me. Is this player here is the question. He's here, and he hits white up there. Interesting. So 39s, a lot of off-cap troops from this player. He did miss a card as well. We're getting 28 now. Um, just want to make sure my caps are nicely defended. I'm going to hit here on this turn. We have a joker. That's big. I'm not going to use that. We'll get to five cards. hits up that way 38 a turn so i'm getting 28 white's getting 22 blue's getting 38 but blue i think is skill wise potentially the worst player in this group but he's defending this bonus pretty heavily just take this take this i don't know where the cap is down here so this card block is not free it's going to be an expensive one, but it is one, two, three with this capital, plus this capital two on the back side. Um, again, not going to set in, but we are going to continue committing troops to cap, which it does not seem like the blue player is doing. He's very concerned about defending his bonuses. We've got white all the way up to 189 up here. Wants to leave territories in front of his cap open. But we have reached that standstill point where players are not actively hitting. We do have to use the Joker. That's unfortunate. No card block opportunities on white. Blue sets in early. His trades are only, what, that was 65? It's still pretty early in terms of trades. Interesting. I don't know how I feel about blue trading in here. I'm not, I'm not sure that that's the right play. 60 bomb up here. It's me. 
stops, sits. Does he think he's card blocking me? That's my question. Not going to do anything about that as it stands right now. It's a lot of troops, though. Get this cap up to 100. I could take his cap out from underneath him right now and effectively treat him like a bot. Honestly, I'm not going to do it yet. I'm going to wait. But I probably should do it. A lot of off-cap troops right now. This is why I'm not doing it. The 300 there is massive. If blue finally decides to put troops on cap, good for him. I think next trade in, if he if this stays as a 50 next trade in, I take this capital. No, it's not. He's going to dump everything. Yeah, he, he realized. He's, he wisened up. Is he going to break me? No, he's going to go over to the right. Yeah, opens up white's cap. That's bold. Once I have a set, I think I got a strike. This player needs to be whittled at least a little bit. But that is time is not now. They are slow, but white is too strong now. That's the issue is, is blue stops pounding into white, so white is getting too strong. And if I'm white and I see me blast into blue, I would do something about it, right? Probably. And everything went to this. He's He hasn't been placing much on cap. If there's a cap back here, I can... That was a mistake. Perfect timing, though, because now it looks justified that I would retaliate. And now... I maybe hit too many troops there. But hopefully, White sees that and does something in response. That may have been aggressive. I honestly just didn't think there was going to be a 98 sitting here when I blasted through that. Um, no, come on. Do something. He had nothing on this capital. He was just defending externally. And now he's going to retaliate. Going to swing around and take this cap? That's fine. I don't care if he does that. I weakened him considerably. If he doesn't roll this cap, this cap wasn't even that good to begin with. I'm totally fine with that. And he doesn't have anywhere to fortify this back to right now. If he doesn't take this, he has to take this cap. The end goal of that maneuver has to be to take my cap. Yeah, he loses 33. That's fine. I didn't want all that junk anyway. And he still leaves a bunch of crap off capital. So how much does he have down here then? Nothing. Let's defend your caps, bro. I mean, he's actually... White could kill him on this next turn. The problem is, is we've both been at three cap. We keep trading these capitals. If he rolls me, I don't think he's going to roll me. I think he's going to skirt around. Hey, he's going to go check this out. He sees that blue went up here. 
He doesn't know that I don't have this. If he rolls that cap, he doesn't roll the cap. He goes back. Interesting. But we've put this player in dire, uh, just absolutely dire position. But we've also taught somebody that they should sit on their caps. So maybe I got, I got overly aggressive, but I mean, blue is the, well, he's not the weakest player yet. It'll be the weakest after I set in. I mean, you, you can come roll this. You can take all these bonuses too. I've been a homie with white all game, bro. You're not going to, you're going to find that there's stuff back here and that I'm defended. Yeah. Take all these territories. I do not care. Hit white. Weird. All right, let's set in. Leaves this 59 on me. I don't like that, but as long as I'm defended enough in here, I should be fine. I'm just trying to whittle him down here. Well, he'll have one territory down there that he can work with. He's laughing, but I, it's like I don't really care. At this point, white wins because blue didn't defend his stuff. And he broke me. Honestly, I, I, did, I didn't need to be broken. That was that was the biggest thing. I, I didn't really care. He, he was hitting white the whole time he decided to turn on me. At that point, you know, you've made, you've made up your mind. You can place all these troops down here all you want. You're just going to lose him. This is, this is futile. I, I don't understand. You're not going to hold this. All, all that really needs to happen is he gets caught with his pants hanging down with this crap off cap up here. Or something along those lines. I don't think he's going to, but... My caps are well defended. Blue's the easier kill. Are you really... Bring in a hundred and something. Dude, are you kidding me right now? Why would you do this? Why would you put this here? All right. I'm going to give white this kill pretty much. I'm not going to defend this cap at all. Because he didn't leave anything on this, did he? No, of course he didn't. Good game. I'm trying to I'm trying to tell White that the game is over. Go kill him, White. He's trying to dodge my capital. He's making sure I cleared him out up here. He's gonna roll the cap. I left him in the pocket, and he's going to go kill him in the pocket. Good game. Well played, Blue! See ya! <laughs> so
So he didn't leave a whole lot on these caps. He's going to have a ton of troops, though. He's going to set in off of this. How do we make up this deficit? Where can I card block? If he's smart, he'll break everything. Take this cap, break everything. Oh, if he hits that, that's huge, though. Takes me out of here. Right, 284 sits on the cap down in there. And then he splits between that and this cap. Yeah, so we break... That was almost an instantaneous split. Which means he didn't leave anything back there. Uh, this actually might be winnable. Uh, 50. Shoot. He did leave something back here. Interesting. There's an 81 over there. Alright. We don't open his cap. He's getting 20. I got how much? 21. That won't last. But I got an additional capital defended and I don't have a Unfortunately, he doesn't break down here. He's going to come back and dip, but I'm surprised he would path like that. A noob no more! Welcome to the stream! Why didn't I just kill Blue? Ah, I couldn't have killed... I don't think I could have killed Blue. Um, Maybe I could have. I think it would have been a little tight. I honestly didn't even think about it. Because I would have had to roll this. I would have had to hit his cap. And I didn't have that much more than, than him here. Uh, or that much more than double, where if I got a really bad roll, um, I mean, yeah, this, this is over. If I got a really bad roll on the cap, then I wouldn't even have the luxury of being able to, uh, I still let me hold France. Interesting. Um, eight, and then this here, sure. Uh, awful dice. Holy shoot. I lost a troop on every roll there. That's awful. Um, yeah, basically, I, I didn't... Oh, you know what? I might as well just hit this guy's... Nope, didn't mean that. It's awkward. He's going to set before me. He'll take at least one of these capitals. It's going to get like 50, yeah, 40 troops there. Yeah, I, I could have killed him. I don't know. I had like, what, one 130 here. He had 60-something on cap. And then uh, and then there was the, the 140 here. So I could have hit that with 100. I don't know. It would have been tight. It would have been pretty tight. And I would have set off it, sure. But then then uh, white, li white wins instantly because I'm so weak from the kill. Whereas... This way, White's locked his cap. He's put himself in some degree of jeopardy. I still don't have a set, which is unfortunate, but I at least have an attack off capital here. Um, he still has not broken France. I have this 11 sitting here. I don't know why I have that there. Uh, how much did he leave on this? Probably a bunch, you know, 40. Um, now you know what, let's throw this over here. Alright, so he'll set in first, and I get to react to the set in. So where do I block him? Because he has most of these capitals if he doesn't take these bonuses. Maybe he'll take the bonuses, that would be nice. I, I don't really think there's a realistic way in which I win this, but so I'll take second place. But yeah, basically I was getting second place either way. I think that not killing blue extended the second place at least a little bit further because I'm not the one incurring the troop losses and the trades weren't high enough where white did lose troops by killing blue but he gained positioning and now he's recouping all of those troops realistically I need this player to force me into a situation where I have a reverse on him um, 
which I mean I can block one one two eh, I would like to break this bonus but theoretically I could block one two three four not even four one two three four five six um, we at least have to kind of turn this on its head a little bit I don't even think I care about this stuff back here I need to chunk down all of this over here so and somehow figure out how to reverse card block uh, and the only way that's going to start is by taking ground away from him so we're not going to start the block yet but I am going to hit as much of him as I can Hopefully we get a, a trade on three. I can actually hit that too. This cap is here. Um, and then we'll hit all of this that doesn't open up cap as well. Just to have as much territory removed as possible. Bring it back to capital. And maybe, just maybe, there will be a set on three. Not optimistic. He's still getting 20 a turn. I have a set on three. Okay. Uh, this is hard, but it's not impossible. If he comes off this 50 here, I don't want to hit this because this opens this 26 up out to an exit. He's not going to be able to break this. That's good. That's an improvement. He'll get down into here. There's a legitimate possibility of a, of a block forming. Um, although he, he lets me hold territory, right? So how much do I get here? I get 24. I've got more than him. I don't want to trade in if I'm getting more than him. So. Let me go break an additional bonus. And then operate off this. I, I don't. Because a set on three. A block is great. But if I'm getting more than him, it means he's not doing enough. And I can force him to trade. That's unfortunate. Um. That's, he, he fortified off cap. That's an interesting play. He fortified off his cap down there. So he'll hold this bonus. He's going to get more than me now, right? Not 25, one more than me. But he comes off this spot. So does he open the cap? No, he bursts to the side. Okay. He'll be on five cards here. That's unfortunate. I got to try to pay attention to the fortify path that this, that this stack takes. Oh, he wins the two on them. That's brutal. That was really unfortunate that I wasn't able to break this. Got three caps. They're all close together, which is good. That's how I can win this. He does get all of that, though. Um, do I hit him knowing he's going to set in? He's not the fastest in the world. Fortifies off cap to go down there. That's not good. All right. I'm going to set in because I need to, I need to take ground here. Um... And how we're going to do that is 60. Should that be enough? I think that'll be enough. And we'll dip in down here. Oh. Okay, sick. He didn't actually effectively block this. And I know, I understand fully that he's just going to... Uh... I know he's going to have a trade here real soon. But it's a risk I've got to take. Do I knock him out of here to force him to have to go further? It didn't work. Uh, and then lock my cap? No, I don't lock my cap. I can't afford to lock my cap. So he sets in now. And he might just set a block. That's part of the reason why I left myself this card. But he's not fast. That's what I was trying to go off of here. And, and this might actually be okay. Okay, he's trying to set a block now. But he, he's not going to get into the back door here. So I'm at least going to get some troops off of that. This is an attempt. He's trying to set up a block of his own. The white player's not bad. I honestly think blue could have just killed him and we wouldn't be in this predicament, but we're trying, everybody. I'm, I'm trying to make a dent. It's not the easiest thing in the world here. And if he's smart, he's just going to set up a wave of blocks here across, uh, across this. Once he hits here, this is when he should start blocking. He should split. That's exactly what he's going to do. This is not enough to stop me from getting a card, unfortunately, because I'm he either opens a cap 
I don't know why he hasn't come off of this and just held here. Um, yeah, I get through that pretty, pretty easily. Um... Hopefully, oh. unfortunate. All right, so we broke some. We didn't get to Russia. It gets 32. We have a trade. How do I block him now? He's getting more than me. Now we actually have to attempt to block, but he's on. He, the problem is he's just, he's a card ahead of me. I can react to his plays. I honestly think that's the only way I'm going to be able to successfully block him. To go fortify to the 12. No. Nope. All right. So we go through the 12. We just need him to trade in again. This bonus I had to break. He's going to get through me on this turn. He's going to actually block me on this turn. I probably just concede at this point. I don't think this is winnable. Um, he's just got too much board. I'm too condensed. And I was too far behind. But he'll trade on the next turn. And I, I should be able to get through that seven, one of these 17s. Uh, but if I, if I hit this 17, I open his cap and just kind of lose straight up. So we're going to try to hit this one. I'm just going to blitz it. Not going to get a better roll. All right. So we take here, which is unfortunate. Didn't want to have to do that. We're at least on five cards. That is a terrible roll. 20, 24 on 23 on 21. That should be pretty high, like 70% plus. I know some people have some calculators that, that do it. I don't, unfortunately, have that luxury. Um, but. Oh, interesting. He's just skirting. He's going to come take a cap, isn't he? That's unfortunate. That's probably the game once he rolls this. Yeah, bang. Loses 64. I would just hit this one, too. Good game. I'll just step off the caps. I'll make one final run for it for fun, and uh, but this this is not going to be fruitful. Um, or can I actually turn the game on him here? Take this cap. Yeah, let's try this. Did him taking that cap actually amount to a mistake? That's my question here. Because I took him out of here, so this is a spot I've removed him from. I actually got a pretty good roll on that, didn't I? The start of that turn, I hit for a nearly even 63-54 trade. So he comes down, six on four is not guaranteed. Wow, he wins it. But look, I hold all of this. If he rolls another cap, do I have a set on three? I have a set up because I have a joker. Not going to be able to block him, but he's not going to be able to take everything in here. And he might even open up the 7 as another spot I can attack with. He does open up the 7. So we fortify off the 83. I get 30. I'm, I'm ahead of him. He got less than 30, right? He got 15. Alright. Let's just play off this. And I have the set. I might be able to get... I need him to trade in, right? I can't do that until we get him to trade. Oh, let's hit this too. Just 
just knock him as far below as he can. I honestly think taking that cap that he did might have been a mistake. I don't want to put much on this one because it's tucked away. I need to make sure this one's defended so he can't roll it with a trade-in. If he rolls this with a trade-in, it is what it is. The 128 sitting up here is, is pretty good. But um, I really thought this was over. We have a set without the Joker. That's big. Because again, okay, he opens the cap. He opens another cap. He's going to come check this one too. He, he's actually giving up on, on keeping my caps close. He's just trying to break bonuses at this point. That's actually massive. Because this, he doesn't have enough time to remove me down here. Which, okay, he doesn't remove me down there. So I'm not going to get that many troops on this turn, but... Doubles back. Interesting. I don't know. This might, I might be able to turn this around. i got to make sure I break him. Take him out. I'm going to leave a defense here. It just kind of froze up. Interesting. All right, so we don't hit that. I got this five here. I can attack more of his territories. He's taken quite a bit of me out, but if he's smart on this next turn, he's just going to remove me here anyway. So we attack off our 104. Come up here with a 10. Sure. Uh, I'm going to hit this. I don't... I'm going to leave the 41 open for now. We'll hit to here. I'm going to hit all of this. And then... Hit all of this. And then... Don't want to commit too much to this maneuver over here. And that's fine that we don't win that. Uh, do I want to leave these cards? I think I want to leave these cards. Oh, well, now we, we have a set. We have the Joker. Dumps everything up there. And he sets in. I think you wanted the bonuses. Ah, uh, maybe. How much did he get? I, I want to make sure I have cards later, quite frankly. He got 14. I started that turn with 17. So not the end of the world, but he's traded in now. And look at how long he's taking to make this decision, right? He hasn't placed anything to break this bonus down here. So he's going to win this back. But maybe I can strengthen this cap and then actually set a block of my own here in a minute. He doesn't have time to, to hit everything, I don't think. He's not fast enough. Maybe he does. He could get to Daenerik. He's not even going to remove me down here. He's just trying to... He's trying to break the bonuses. That's fair. And he didn't hit this either. He leaves me with that? He does. He leaves me with Iceland. Okay. Um. Left, leaves a bunch off cap. Where can I... I, I think you're right. I think I want the bonuses because I can also set up the block on this turn. We set the block. So here's what we do. We come down here with 30, I think. Um, up here with, we're going to need to be split this 60 and then whatever I've got left, I'm going to come off cap with here. And, oh, hang on. I need... This isn't enough, but I at least got to try. All right, let's go. Well, if he's got a set, he, he wins because I'm actually he's gonna get this anyway. I, I messed that up. I meant to reverse the other way. He can he can cap run here if he's smart. I didn't send enough over here. I I missed fortified. Protect my fortified. I probably should have. Uh, I made an oopsie though. <laughs> I meant to scroll the other way. I only wanted to leave like ten over here. He's mad because he he was forced to trade in. So I'll have a set as well in response. This was going to be his only card anyway. So, you know, maybe I wanted to send that over here. He's taken too long to decide, though. So, he might win these caps. But he's not going to have a fortify yet from over here. I mean, he's going to have to roll this. He, he just traded in, dude. You've got all these troops to place. Does he think he can't win or something? Because now I'm just going to set in and I'm going to fortify everything. 
If he doesn't make a move here, it doesn't take his... He has cards in Orient. He does have cards in Orient. That's right. I don't know why he thought he didn't have anything. He didn't even have to roll the cap. And now he has to roll the cap because he didn't place these troops anywhere. So they even split. How the heck did this work? All right, I... Do I even have to trade in then? 51 troops? Uh, yeah, I'm going to trade in just to be safe. I know it's the Joker, but... Uh, that he can... He, the problem is all of these positions he can dunk a bunch of troops into. Uh, I'm going to leave myself cards up here. I haven't broken... I want him to have as few troops as possible. Uh, he might get enough to hit that. Fourteen. Alright. I, I This should be adequate, I think. I, li I leave myself cards up here. I don't know how the heck I turn this around. And he still has a bunch on that on both these caps. So it's not... It's not over. He can fortify off, but if for some reason he bots out now because he just quit, I have no idea. I, this player was pretty good, too. He even had the concept of trying to block. Admittedly, didn't leave enough troops in several places, but I honestly think the crushing move from this game was him taking this cap. I don't think that was the right play because it gave me the opportunity to take this cap, which closed him out of here, and then he's only operating from two positions. It's the only way off this cap. It honestly forced him into a block on himself up here. So if he bots out... Wow. So we, we know we have cards up here. I have no idea how I turn this around. This is... He might have the troop placement bug. Maybe. That would be... I, I didn't know that was a thing. Is that a thing? I have not stumbled upon that myself. But that's really unfortunate if that's the case. I feel bad. Um... Okay, that, I've got tons of cards I can take. This cap, I think, has less on it, so in terms of risking a fortify, I, I should take cards down there, uh, because he could fortify up into multiple positions up here. So, let's do that. There's a 10 down here. Uh, okay, that's okay. Um... What do I pull from this one? 14. Could He could get... 20 on 22 is winnable, but I, this also sacking all of this stuff into a stack down here is also winnable, so... True placement bug would be unfortunate. I didn't know that was a thing. I, I would feel very bad for this player if that happened. Is that something on mobile, maybe? Um, but if that's not the case, and he gave up, then cool. This was wild, and I'm glad it worked out on all platforms. Interesting. Um, I have not heard of that, but somehow this wacky game all through and through has been flipped on its head, uh, and, and maybe this player... I do feel bad if they have a bug. Um, somehow I've gained at least a somewhat stable position, but he probably has a bunch on this capital... I am sorry, sir. Great determination not giving up. I appreciate that. That was the goal here is, is once, you know, I took a risk with the opportunity of rolling this cap and just tried. And, uh, and especially with some of the stuff that Blue did, sometimes you just got to try. All right. This is a, a known commodity there. Uh, and what we're going to do is we're going to pull some of these troops back up here. That should be safe enough. Looks like the troop placement bugs. He, he hasn't bought it out. That stinks, man. That's unfortunate. Um, can you, like, close your app and open it back up? Or maybe he's tried to do that. I feel like it would bottom out right away if he tried it. Oh, he has bought it out. I wonder if he comes back. I haven't, I haven't experienced this bug. I've seen people just, like, quit randomly and never return. 85. Sometimes reopening the app works. Most of the time it doesn't. That's unfortunate, man. All right, we're going to hit this then. 
I've got three cards to give, so... Um... Oh, that wasn't even everything off the capital. Alright, well, the bot is going to get... Uh... That was sitting in the corner, wasn't it? The bot's going to get a card. <laughs> Good for you, bot. <laughs> Free card. Um, I'm on four. I have a set now. That's good. Hopefully it attacks with a 57. Sick. That's perfect. That's actually going to hit me, isn't it? It's going to hit my 34. Oh, no. <laughs> Loses 31. All right. Uh, do I clear out? Ooh. Okay. We just whacked that. I think I win now. Do I win or do I give him the opportunity to come back? That's the ultimate question, right? Um... I think it's I think I should just win so I'm gonna do that it's a little unfortunate but split just in case if somehow I don't win don't think I can world dom here <laughs> yeah uh, well a little bit of a cheeky Maybe somewhat sleazy win at the end there. This is the almost world dom, I call it. We'll miss four territories. But we'll take a win regardless. Uh, I'll do my... I will show the ranks. I'll do my sign-off. Uh, at least for the YouTube video. I'll keep going on Twitch. I got, I got one more game on me. This was the second game we've played. Um, let's see. Let's see what we got here. We've got... GM! Alright, yeah, that guy wouldn't have bought it out. That that definitely was the true placement bug that you're talking about. That's unfortunate for him. There was still a fight left. Um, wait, I'm, I might be misunderstanding what you're saying. But, uh, yeah, Grandmaster, he definitely had a bug, man. He could have he could have overcome that for sure. That's unfortunate. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you're catching it on YouTube... Go find me on Twitch. That's where a noob no more and some other people are watching this game. If you wanna, uh, if you did enjoy though, hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. I upload videos just like this one every single day. Comment down below what you thought about it. If you wanna catch a video that YouTube recommends for you, right here above my head, the subscribe button in the upper right hand corner. As always, everybody, I have been C Money. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a tremendous rest of your day. Peace.